It's not a fault at all of the drone or the software, it's entirely on me. So, super exciting news. My drone arrived. I'm dying to play with this thing. It's been... So for those of you that don't know the story, this drone arrived, I'm getting it sent from a company in China called PowerVision. They're a very innovative company coming out of China. They were sending this to me for free to use to show in a video. But then when it arrived, it got stuck in customs, probably because of all these kind of stickers all over it. But anyway, it got stuck in customs. I had to pay import fees. I had to pay for an import license. I had to pay tax. I had to pay all this crap just to get it in. It was going to cost me 6,000 baht to bring in. I got a donation from someone on PayPal, through PayPal. SMXLPTYLTD. They sent me through the, it was going to cost me 6,000 baht. They sent me 6,000 baht. So if you're watching, thank you so much. That's so generous of you. I can't wait to see this thing. Oh man, this thing looks cool already. I can't wait to play with it. So this is it, the Power Egg X by PowerVision. Autonomous personal AI camera, capture life. So I'm just reading up on the specs of this thing. This is a camera and you can put the propellers on it and it becomes a drone. So it's an AI camera that will track you and follow you wherever you go. Or you put the propellers on it and use it like a normal drone. So the specs for the drone are actually really impressive. It shoots at 4K, which is awesome. The flight time is 30 minutes, which is a good flight time. Its maximum flight distance is 3.7 miles. That seems like a long way. What's that in? What's 3.7 miles in real person distance? 5.9, six kilometers? This thing goes six kilometers away? That's insane. Oh, I'm so glad I ended up getting this thing. This is amazing. to say so far I am super impressed the packaging is way nicer than I expected it to be ooh and just wow this is the egg this is the actual camera ooh it feels and looks so nice I've got the remote remote looks awesome as well and these are once you put this on it becomes a drone oh, wow really cool All right, I need to watch some instructions for how to do this so I don't break it This is a look at the drone or the camera. This it, it's a camera if you use it like this. And the wings. Whoa! And this is it as a drone. Man, it looks so cool. I'm loving this thing. This looks so cool. I'm dying to use it. I just, I can't. It's the nighttime now and it's raining. Look at this. Nighttime, horrible rain. I'm going to have to finish up here, but I'll come back tomorrow and we'll throw this thing up in the air. I need to watch some tutorials and stuff on it anyway. I can't wait to use this. So it's now about two weeks later. It's a beautiful day. I'm here by the beach. This is the perfect place to test out this drone. Now, as I mentioned, I shot the first part of this video two weeks ago. So if I'm repeating myself with any of these things, I do apologize. So this drone has some great features that I'm really excited about. I think to me, the most impressive thing about this is how sort of heavy and solid it feels. And not heavy as in like it's gonna be annoying to carry around. Heavy as in it's gonna be great up in the air. Today's quite windy, so it'd be good to put, really put it to the test. And it just looks really cool. Now, the features that I'm most excited about is firstly, it shoots in 4K, which is great. My other drone I have doesn't shoot in 4K. And then I think the biggest draw card for me is it's actually got sensors all around it. So it's virtually uncrashable, which is good because I've sent mine into trees and all sorts of things. I always manage to get it back, but it'd be great just to know that I'm not going to be able to crash this thing. Look how still it sits. I like that. 
It's just not moving at all. Even though it's windy here, it's just hovering perfectly. All right, let's send this puppy out there. I think the main thing that stands out to me about this drone is just how solid it feels in the air. You know, I mentioned it's quite heavy, like not heavy as in it's too heavy, but it's, it's got a good decent weight to it. So it doesn't get blown around in the wind or anything like that because it is quite windy here. And I sent it like really far away. And obviously being able to shoot in 4K is a huge plus for me, but I want to take this drone to a different part of the beach and have some more fun with it. Man, I am having so much fun with this thing. I just realized I got a whole bunch of great shots, doing all really cool things with the drone and then realized it wasn't recording and it's not a fault at all of the drone or the software, it's entirely on me. But I'm hoping I still got some great shots. Regardless, the flying experience was really, really good. Oh man, I'm just, I'm so impressed with this drone. So full transparency, I was sent this for free. So I may be a little biased in how much I'm enjoying it, but this is something I would definitely buy one of these. You know, I think it's great value for money. The drone itself flies really good. The footage is great, great 4K footage. It has a whole bunch of really cool features that I really like. And I genuinely do think it's an awesome drone. So I've drained the battery completely now. So I'm gonna go home, charge it up, and hopefully I'll get it up again this afternoon. come back down to the beach God, what a day for rainy season this is just oh, so good about this drone is I can talk at any time and it records what I'm saying so it actually uses the controller to record what I'm saying so I can be flying and talking about what I'm seeing as I'm flying it which is really cool So my final thoughts on this thing, this thing is awesome. I'm really, really impressed. For a brand that I hadn't heard of, you know, I wasn't sure what to expect. I had no idea how good it was gonna be. This thing flies really well. I've been back and I've looked at the image quality and the 4K image quality is fantastic. It's got great range. It's got really cool features like the sensors and everything. There's a lot to like about this drone. I won't go through all the specs. There's so much to list. So jump over and check out the website. I'll leave a link for them below. But man, this, I'm, I'm super impressed. Thank you, PowerVision, for this. I'm gonna use this a lot. Yeah.